hello you're welcome how to solve this nice exponential equation here let's use two method here the first method from what we have here which is x raised to power x equals to 2 raised to power 8 plus 2x here we apply the law of indices a raised to power m plus n same thing as a raised to power m times a raised to power n. That is what we have here becomes x raised to power x equals to 2 raised to power 8 times 2 raised to power 2x. Which also implies here we have x raised to power x equals to 2 raised to power 8 times 2 square raised to power x here from the law of indices and here we can equally write this as x raised to power x equals to 2 raised to power 8 times 2 square here we have 4 then raised to power x then here next step we divide both sides by 4 raised to power x divide this side by 4 raised to power x and also this side by 4 raised to power x. Then 4 raised to power x cancel each other here. Then we are left with x raised to power x over 4 raised to power x equals to 2 raised to power x here. Then here, this follows from when we have a raised to power n over b raised to power n, which is equals to a over b or raised to power n. Then here we have x over 4 all raised to power x then equals to 2 raised to power 8. The next step from here multiply both sides by the power of 1 over 4. So here we have x over 4 raised to power x then raised to power 1 over 4 here also equals to 2 raised to power 8 then raised to power 1 over 4 from here then from the law of indices this power multiplies and this gives us x over 4 raised to power x over 4 then equals to here 4 goes here 1 and 4 goes here 2 so we have 2 raised to power 2 here. Then when we compare this from here, we have the base same thing as the power. Also the base same thing as the power. Then we have x over 4 here equals to 2 from here. Which is same thing as 2 over 1. Cross multiply here. x times 1, that's x equals to 2 times 4, that's 8. So here we have x equals to 8 from here. Then let's look at the second method. From what we have here, we take the log on both sides. Then we have log x raised to power x equals to log 2 raised to power 8 plus 2x. Then from the power law of logarithm, when we have log m raised to power p, which is same thing as p log m then here what we have becomes x log x equals to the power here we have 8 plus 2x then log 2 from here that is here we can simplify further and log 2 open this bracket then here we have x log x equals to here we have 8 times log 2 that's 8 log 2 then we have log 2 times 2x that's plus 2x log 2 then let's bring the like terms together that is the one with x to one side then here we have x log x here then taking plus 2x log 2 here become minus 2x log 2 then equals to 
8 log 2 on this side. Then from what we have here, x is common, we factor it out, and here we have x into bracket log x minus 2 log 2 left here, close bracket, then equals to 8 log 2 from here. Then here, we reverse the power law of logarithm, that is 2 here can come up, and we have x into bracket log x minus log 2 squared here equals to 8 log 2 from here which is also same thing as x into bracket log x minus log 4 then equals to 8 log 2 from here and from the law of logarithm, when we have log a minus log b, this is the same thing as log a over b. Then what we have here simply can be written as x multiplied by log x over 4, then equals to 8 log 2 on this side that is from here let's divide both side by 4 divide this side by 4 and also divide this side by 4 then here we can write this as x over 4 times log x over 4 equals to here 4 goes here 1 and 4 goes here 2 so equals to 2 log 2 from here and also when we compare this from here the coefficient here is x over 4 and here is equals to 2 here so crossing multiply from here this implies we have x equals to 8 or we can say here we have log x over 4 then equals to log 2 and here the log here cancel out also we are left with x over 4 equals to 2 and crossing multiply as well this implies we have x equals to 8 which is same thing with what we have in the first method then we can check if this will satisfy the given problem that is from what we have here we substitute the value of x which is equals to 8 then x equals to 8 here what we have becomes 8 raised to power 8 is equals to 2 raised to power 8 plus 2 times 8 then here what we have here which is 8 raised to power 8 is equals to 2 raised to power here we have 8 plus 2 times 8 here give us 16 then which implies 8 raised to power 8 here is equals to 2 raised to power 8 plus 16 here we have 24 then since on this side we can rewrite 8 here as 2 times 2 times 2 which is 2 raised to power 3 then here we have 2 raised to power 3 then raised to power 8 is equals to 2 raised to power 24 then since this power multiplies and 3 times 8 here that's 24 that's 2 raised to power 24 equals to 2 raised to power 24 now the left hand side equals to the right hand side and hence from here we conclude that x equals to 8 satisfy this given problem and thank you for watching don't forget this step subscribe for more videos and turn on notification bell share this video give it a thumbs up see you next class and bye for now